My name is Terry, and this is Porkchop. Recently, we were out for a walk, and afterward, I noticed that Porkchop was thinking about something. Do you know what Porkchop is thinking about? Maybe he's thinking about bacon. Wait, no, I think Porkchop is thinking about fall. That's right. What a perfect time of year with the leaves changing colors and the start of cooler weather. But what is Porkchop thinking about now? Oh yeah, it's obvious. He's thinking about the great composer Antonio Vivaldi. Or maybe Bacon. No, I'm pretty sure it's Vivaldi. Vivaldi composed music a long, long time ago during the Baroque period in the early 1700s. So now I think I know what Porkchop is thinking about. Vivaldi plus fall? He's thinking about one of Vivaldi's most famous compositions, Autumn from the Four Seasons. So first, we will take a closer look at Vivaldi's composition using our new online composition program called Compose It. We are going to focus on the rhythms that Vivaldi uses in Autumn. Then, at the end of the video, I will ask you to compose a melody that imitates these same rhythmic patterns. So here is Vivaldi's opening melody from Autumn. Notice how we have different rhythmic durations, some shorter rhythmic durations and some longer durations. Let's zoom into the first series of notes. Do you see a pattern? I notice that we have some shorter, faster moving rhythms here that are followed by a longer duration rhythm. Then again, we have shorter duration rhythms with these purple eighth notes that come to a rest on a longer duration blue quarter note here. This pattern continues through the opening section of the music. Listen as Vivaldi uses a series of faster moving notes that are always followed by a longer note. Let's zoom into another section. In this part of Vivaldi's melody, we have the faster moving eighth notes coming to a brief rest on the quarter note. And then again. But check out this part of the melody in the green box. Do you see some new rhythms? Yes, the dark purple sixteenth notes move even faster. But Vivaldi still maintains the same rhythm pattern of fast moving notes coming to a brief rest on the longer duration quarter note. Let's listen to this section one more time. See if you can follow the rhythm pattern of short to long rhythms. <laughs> Now it's time for us to compose a melody that has the same rhythmic pattern as Vivaldi's Autumn. I created this melody on the Compose It Online program by dragging and dropping the rhythmic shapes up onto the musical graph. Do you see Vivaldi's rhythm pattern in my new melody? Does my melody move from fast moving rhythms to longer duration rhythms? Do you notice anything different? Let's listen to the melody. So my melody started out on faster moving eighth note rhythms, just like Vivaldi, but instead of coming to a rest on one quarter note, my melody has two quarter notes. Now it's your turn. Visit the nbsymphony.org website and go to the Learning in Concert online page. There you can click on the Compose It game and compose your own melody. Let's see if you can create a melody that imitates Vivaldi's rhythm pattern. Faster moving rhythms that are followed by longer duration rhythms. Please save your melodies and send them back to me at the symphony.
We will be featuring some student melodies on our website with video performances by our musicians. To save your melody, click on the Save button, then enter a title for your melody and fill in your name as composer. Then click on the download arrow to save the melody to your computer. Check back often as we will be adding new videos where we explore music from other great composers and see how we can use the Compose It Online program to understand their techniques and to create our own music. Porkchop says thanks for watching.